uh, it's like the it's like the it's like the neighborhood got together and wanted to to, to do something urgently nice for for people that were uh, um, unable to wash their hair or wash their clothes or, or have somewhere to stay, have nowhere to go, sure. and and so that they wouldn't get frostbite over the winter. It was it's kind of, it was a loving thing to do. compared to other places where you stay? Oh, different, yeah, way, very different. And how's that? Um, 23 years ago I was I was homeless the first time, this is the second time, and I just started again the second time, but in the other homeless shelter and in, in, uh, in other cities, it was uh, very dangerous. <clears throat> you know, uh, it, was over, it was just an overnight sleeping place too, just like this, and you really did have to worry about Somebody assaulting you, or you know, using a weapon, and you didn't know for sure, and and uh, yelling. On my right and left, in length and height and breadth, with you I will not fear, whether far or whether near. I rise today. It's like neighborhood family, and especially, especially if you're from this area and you were found yourself in different parts of the country and you got beaten up in that city and you, you got pushed out of out the door into some other city and you were trying to make a living and you couldn't and <clears throat> and uh, even got uh, discriminated and had to come back to the home to home area. I found in La Crosse uh, this warming center is that it wasn't. That it was if you were if you were from this general area, especially the TV market, and and you uh, kind of knew the culture. That meant that that meant that uh, you were kind of family, yeah. and that's the, how it felt. Was that the, the neighborhood decided to help people who uh, were out of family. Uh, final thoughts of it's wrapping up is that is that uh, he did just enough and it was